Well, hello there, and welcome to my magazine blog. I want to talk to you today about the different covers that you get, and specifically, or more specifically, saddle stitch and perfect bind. Now, just very briefly as an explanation, saddle stitch is when you take a magazine, this is one of mine, and you put two staples, high pressured staples, see, and you put these two staples in the spine, and by doing that, you staple together the magazine. That's what we call saddle stitch. Then we have something else, another one of my magazines, called perfect bind. Perfect bind is when you have a, f a, a spine, a nice flat spine that can carry some text, etc., and categorize and, and tell you what issue it is and so on. This is a, a smaller perfect bind, as you can see, etc. The difference between the two? Well, as you know, we print in 8s, 16s, 32s. So, first of all, for saddle stitch, when you're working out your, your uh, flat plan, your pagination, what you're doing is you're working it out, including the cover. In other words, for example, a saddle stitch, which is usually about a 48-pager, perhaps a 64-pager, that includes cover. When you're talking about perfect bind, the cover is separate. And the reason it's separate is because what we do is we print, I don't know if you can see it here, but there are little sections of, of, of stitching together that compress to, to form the hole with the spine. This, you need 64 pages to do a perfect bind. If you don't have 64 pages, perfect bind looks terrible. If you do have 64 pages or more, it's best to have a perfect bind. The problem with saddle stitching is it looks cheap. The truth is it's much cheaper. So if you want to have a high volume of magazines, that is not a huge page number, like 48 page magazine, and you want to cut costs, etc., then you can just get sections of paper. You can, for example, do 48 pages. You can saddle stitch it, and there's no extra cost for the cover. Of course, the treatment of the cover is the same. You still get your UV varnish cover, etc. With Perfect Bind, if you really want to be upmarket and have a magazine that has a nice presence to it, and you've got more than 64 pages, preferably 96 plus, so for example, a 96 plus four page cover, then you go the Perfect Bind route. Perfect Bind route's nice because it's got a spine. It's more expensive though, it's more expensive as a finishing. So, in other words, with a perfect bind, you go 96 plus a four-page cover. And, of course, with a cover section as a separate section, as in perfect binding, you can also have fold-outs, and you can have a whole bunch of things on your cover. Anyway, generally, that's the difference between the two. Saddle stitch or perfect bind. Your choice.